what's up welcome back to my channel today is a summer collection haul in the floor but before we dive in hello welcome if you're new here please subscribe if you haven't already also if you want to become a wickless charm vip the link to my facebook group and the link to subscribe to my wickless weekly newsletter is down below okay guys that's it let's go ahead and dive on in so i just now got my first order of the summer collection for this year because this package um had some delays we're not gonna go into it. But anyways, it's here and I cannot wait to dive in. The summer collection is officially available with Scentsy and this year, I think every year, they keep topping it. Like it just keeps getting better and better. And one of my favorite things about the summer collection this year is the new travel belly, buddy, belly, <laughs> travel buddy pillow. So last year we had our first travel buddy pillow and it, it oh wow, this is weighted. Like it's really memory foamish. Wow. Um, sidetracked. Last year we had our first one, which was the unicorn. And then now we actually have a new mermaid design. And this works just like a Scentsy Buddy. You get a free scent pack of choice. And so the scent pack, it goes in the pouch right here. And I bought this for Maddie because we are about to leave for the beach. And I thought that this would be better. She has a little one like a little taller one but it just doesn't it doesn't do the job you know what I'm saying like it's just too little I was like five bucks but I really like this and it's really squishy and if she doesn't want it then I'm gonna use it um but we have more of the summer collection stuff we have two packs of the summer collection washer whiffs I know this is mine I've been so excited the scent that came in the laundry bundle for the summer collection is water lily and bergamot and i feel like this is a great choice of scent because this is the more like fresh tropical ish one um i really like it whenever you buy the bundle you actually get a full thing of laundry liquid and then you also get two of the small washer whiffs so this will last you a while mm, yeah i think that's going to be great for laundry the washer whips are like the fragrance boost. So think about like downing unstoppables, little things like that. It's not detergent. It's not nothing for static. It is literally just a fragrance boost for your laundry. If I had to choose one laundry product to use and only one, it would be the washer whips. Um, next we have the whiff box. I'm so excited for this. So I have to film a video for the June whiff box. If you have not seen a sink of what's inside, here it is. I'm so happy that, I mean, yeah, this package was delayed, but at least it arrived before Friday because that's whenever we're heading to the beach. And I cannot wait to use the new exclusive mini fan diffuser in that whiff box. But be sure to stay tuned and uh, subscribe to my channel uh, to see that unboxing. Um, next, we have a counter clean and key lime and grapefruit. This was the summer collection um, counter clean. Very excited for this. I really did like the key lime and grapefruit. It reminds me of a like grapefruit version of cocoa lime and this is definitely not going to disappoint so very happy for that um we have a lot of pink pineapple and sugar because this is my personal favorite scent from the summer collection this scent like i mean i knew it was going to be good but like it absolutely wowed me the pink pineapple and sugar is so incredibly delicious and sweet and candy like and fruity if you love the original sugar fragrance if you liked the candy orchard from the january scent of the month if you like the new um imagination land which is in the inside out collection you need to try pink pineapple and sugar this one is definitely up close to i don't have a bar of sugar i don't think i've had it for a while i've been out um but this one is definitely, in my opinion, a twin to the classic sugar fragrance. The performance of this is great. I have three packs of pods, which I believe all three of these are mine. Cannot wait to use the pods in my Whiff Box Mini Fan Diffuser for the ride down to the beach. Um, we got a very bright scent pack. I believe that is for Maddie's Mermaid Travel Pillow. I wanted to get her like a fruity one. That would be good for kids. Um, and we have more pods and a room spray. So I have another pack of pink pineapple and sugar pods. I told you this one's my favorite. Um, a pack of key lime and grapefruit, which is the other summer collection scent that I love. And a pack of Bonfire Beach pods, which y'all know was just a classic. Oh, we also had this. So I got a fragrance flower in the pink pineapple and sugar. The summer collection has three 
fragrance flowers and they're all available in the dainty daisy design they're so cute and whichever like they're all colored so this one's going to be pink and then the water lily and bergamot is going to be like a teal blue color and then the um, key lime and grapefruit is going to be green so i'm going to add some photos that another leader was kind enough to share with us after like 24 to 48 hours this is what the flower <laughs> will look like i'm so excited for this but i'm going to keep this one closed i'm going to put this on my office desk once we get back from the beach um I mean, we're going to be gone for a full week, so I don't want to open it up just yet. Um, and then we have a room spray of pink pineapple and sugar. So I am so in love with the new room spray formula. I've said it before. I never used our room sprays other than whenever we lived in our first house that we had together because our bedrooms had carpet. So our original room spray formula was an oil based so sometimes it would leave like a slippery residue like i mean if you had hardwood floors so you would have to use it like on carpeted for uh, surfaces or like rugs so i never used it because once we built this house we have all hardwood throughout the house but now our room sprays have a water base like a water base to them and they leave no residue i can highly recommend 10 out of 10 I have loved having room sprays. I got the pink pineapple and sugar, and I think I'm gonna take this one to the condo. Okay, so now we have a lot of waxes. So not only do we have the summer collection waxes, but I also have the July Bring Back My Bar line up in here. I'm so excited because not only do we have Bring Back My Bar happening in the month of July, but for the first time ever, we're bringing five of these fragrances back in pods. I'm so happy. I hope that this is going to be like a big event. Like I hope this is going to sell well with the new pods because I would love to see more like pods available and bring back my bar events. Um, but I'm just going to go through the list. Uh, first up, I know this is bring back my bar. We have Buzzworthy, which is not my favorite scent. I did not like this one whenever it was a scent of the month and I'm not going to sniff it. And next we have Wild Watermelon which I love. This used to be in the kids collection whenever we had like a separate like kids fragrance collection in the catalog. Um, um, next we have Sea Sun and Fun, which I think this one's new to me. Very nice, very nice and like oceany airy. Next we have Berry Bubble Blue, which is ooh, delicious. I don't know if I've ever had this. Oh, very good. That reminds me a lot of uh, Candy Crave. Up next, we have Coconut Daiquiri. Very happy to see this one back. That was a summer collection since some years ago. We have Apple Crush, which was, I think this was also a kid scent in the catalog. This is like the perfect, like, sweet tart green apple. Um, up next, for Bring My Bar, we have Breakfast Blend, which is coffee. Of course, it literally smells like coffee beans. <laughs> Um, and then we have Lemon Lavender, which I remember. This one's a really popular one from years ago. Oh, that is so nice. All of these are going to be available or eligible for Cincy Club and I always get my bar. Um, um, next, we have Red Delicious. Oh, this one with this apple crush. Like, this is the Red Delicious apple, and this is the green apple. Oh, my goodness. This one's delicious. If you like Johnny Appleseed, you're going to love this Red Delicious. Up next, we have Juicy Peach. I don't think I've ever had this. Ugh, that's a little too tart and peachy for my personal taste. Next, we got Sea Salt Mist. I think I've had this before. Yeah, just like a oceany, airy. Very nice. And of course, I'm going to do like a whole video all about bringing my bar. This is not my bring up my bar video. Like this is just a little sneak. This is Blackberry Meringue. Yeah, I've had this before. Very yummy. This is kind of what I hoped the blackberry, no, the black raspberry frosting from the black raspberry inspirations. I kind of wanted it to be more like blackberry meringue. It, it just not was, it was not my favorite. Next we have Happy Go Lucky. Been a while since we've had this one. It's definitely one of the lighter scents, but it is like oh so good. Kind of like Luna, how it's like definitely a lighter fragrance, but it's so well loved and it's such a nice fragrance. It's just good. And this, what is this? Ooh, lime and sugar cane. I don't know if I've ever had that before. I don't know if I've ever smelled that. We have Surfer Chick. Oh, oh, nice, nice, nice. Uh, Berries Jubilee. Oh, 
Speaking of Jubilee, the Jam and Jubilee, which is the scent of the month for June right now, one of my hands down favorite fruity scents. It went into my club. That's very nice. Um, Highway Run. This is a manly. Oh, very nice. Manly scent. Manly, manly. Lemon Verbena is back, and I believe this one's for sure coming back as pods too. I know, I think it's Wild Watermelon, Shaka, Lemon Verbena. Can't remember the other ones. Oh, speaking of Shaka. Oh, Shaka. Shaka's coming back. I'm so excited. Farmer's Market. I never liked this one whenever it first released. Now, I'm all about it. My preferences have just changed. I've grown up a little bit. Very nice. Very nice and fresh. Super good. I'm excited for this one. This is sandalwood and cranberry. Oh. Ooh. I cannot wait to warm that. That's going to be a good, like, fall scent. Dark Harbor. I think Dark Harbor is one of the pods. Oh, love it. I've loved it ever since I first smelled it. Let's see. Reggae Sunset. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Interesting. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, next, we have Coconut Citrus Parfait. Ooh. That's creamy and delicious. Uh, well, last but not least, for the Bring Back My Bar, we have Dolce de Leche. Oh. Which is absolutely delicious. This is yummy. Very, very yummy. So that was the 25 Bring Back My Bars. And then we have a six pack of waxes left. And I think this was all for me. Um, we have a pack, or a pack, a wax of Sunset Scott and Strawberry. This is a summer collection scent. Um, this is, it only comes as the wax, or I definitely would have ordered more, but I really do like this one. And then we have a bar of Blooming Marvelous, which was the May scent of the month. I completely wowed me. Did not expect to love it, but I, I truly do. Like, I really feel like it's a stronger version of Summer Holiday, which I loved. Um, next, we have Bonfire Beach. This is one of my just absolute favorites. Year round, have to have it. And then last but not least, we have three of the pink pineapple and sugar waxes. But yeah, that's it. Uh, be sure to stay tuned. I have videos coming up. I'll have the July scent and warmer of the month video and the June Whiff Box unboxing. And we are going to have a full like in-depth like sniffs video of the July Bring Back My Bar. But that is it. Now I have to clean up my mess. Uh, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.